Hey guys, this is Mary with Couponing with Mary, and I am here to do a um, how do I organize my coupons. Um, this is my binder that I take everywhere, and I take it in a bag. Um, I carry this thing wherever I go. Um, I try to get any bag that kind of has, you know, enough room so I can just kind of throw my stuff in there. Um, and my big binder. Um, this is a three inch binder. Um, I did start off with about a one inch and I eventually grew out of it. And so I had to get me a bigger one. But as you see, this one's kind of like, you know, I have to go ahead and kind of do some cleaning on this. Um, I didn't organize it because this is what it looks like every day or every Saturday or every Sunday or Monday or whatever day I go do my couponing. Um, this is what it looks like. So I wanted you guys to see the real deal. And um, so, yeah, guys, um, like I said, this is a three inch binder. It's a little bit beat up um, because I've been doing this for about what is it a little bit over a year already and I am still learning as I'm going especially when uh, all the rules are changing and you know um, just you know you end up just learning every day um, new things and new deals and how to and all that stuff so um, let's get into it um, this is it I usually put my uh, ads either they go in the front or they go in the back um, I have two little pockets where I put uh, some pins and then I I um, try to never go without a um, a notepad um, you guys might it might look familiar with all the chicken scratch that I sometimes show you this is what I take with me and try to do some of the deals um, there at the store and figure out and calculate. Um, here is my Walgreens um, monthly savings book that I keep. Um, so this is this. And then um, have some pencils. These are actually other coupons that I might have used or just had extra or I don't know. They just go in there. Um, there's this other little pocket that I try to keep some scissors. Um, I also have a calculator. And then I also have, um, you know, some of my CRTs, um, receipts and stuff, um, or deals that I just made. Um, let's see. Here is, uh... I try to use some of these, um, what are they called, um, sheet protectors, and this is what I end up using. This is a painting that my son ended up doing for me, so um, I put it here, um, and then what I do is I have them categorized. Um, my daughter helped me kind of, or she did it, at, at, I should say, she wrote names, and then she wrote the name on the side to kind of categorize it. This seems to work better for me. Um, I know a lot of people do the um, the file cabinet where they, um, what is it? They save every, the full insert and they never uh, clip their coupons. I clip my coupons. I take the time. And if I don't have time, they will end up in the back. And I eventually have time. But... Um, I clip my coupons, um, I sit on the couch, and I just clip away, um, we'll put on a movie, um, watch one of my Real Housewives shows or something, and just keep myself occupied and start clipping away. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. I have these baseball cards. I bought these at Walmart, and I think at my Walmart they were about... Four dollars for a set of ten, or for a pack of ten, I mean, um, which is not too bad. And I think I eventually, gradually bought. Um, I think I started off with two, and then it seems like I gradually ended up um, 
buying more. So yeah, guys. Um, so I bought these. They were I want to say about four dollars for a pack of ten, and um, they're I've had them for a year, so they're they're very durable. And I like I said, I clip away. Um, I clip my coupons to where they're gonna go ahead and fit, and then some of these long ones that we usually get, I kind of just fold it in half and then just insert it there. Um, I use both sides. I use the front side and then I will fit some more in the back so that I have more space. But I, yeah, guys, I did categorize them. Shampoo, um, you'll see all my shampoos, stylers, deodorants, lotion, body wash, toothpaste, hair dye and facial care. Um, and then this is what I mean when I say that I use the back side of it, you know. Um, there's makeup, like feminine pads, medicine, air fresheners, household, and then you end up hitting your paper goods, like your paper towels and all that stuff, laundry detergent, and then all the way in the back, I'll start doing the food. And that, I still have it categorized as well. Um, I'll still have these categorized, not as much. They won't have the tabs like these do, but um, I try to put like all the seasonings or the pastas or the dressings, um, all the canned stuff like fruit, um, frozen stuff, um, cheeses or, you know, stuff like this, um, all my meats and that, you know, being... Sorry for the glare. Um, that being like cam and uh, hot links and then all my drinks. So I might not have the taps like I do for like the shampoo and the body lotion and all that stuff. But I still kind of know where things are because then you start going to like the snacks, the cereal um, and stuff like that. And then right at the back, I'll start with my, I'll have my dog food stuff. Um, and so, yeah, and then I have these sheet protectors. So some of this big stuff that I have here um, that I don't want to take the time to clip because I don't know if I'm eventually going to use it. Um, I just put it in one of these and then I'll go through it. Um, and then here are my coupons that I haven't even clipped from, what was it, last week? I still have a bunch. Um, and it's mostly, I think, the PNG, and then, um, as you see, that's why I take scissors, because I go to the store and then eventually realize, oh, I have that coupon. It's not clipped, but um, I go ahead and give it a cut there. Um, and then you'll see some of my food stuff um, in the back. Now, I do have this big envelope right here is where I keep all my receipts. This is where all the receipts are kept. And I think I've kept literally every receipt that I've had. Like, literally, I've kept every receipt that I have. Let me see if I can just get one from the back and kind of see what date that is. This is a deal for the L'Oreal. I don't know what this was. You know what? This was, um, this was, um hair dye this was a hair dye deal and it looks like it was a foundation from cover girl i had coupons and it looks like i had my that might have been an ecb and my subtotal was zero let's see what the date it was yep it sounds about right july july is when i kind of started doing this um so this might have been my one of my first ones or maybe one of my second third weeks into it but July is when I started doing this, and um, you can see here what my year-to-date was for that year, 2015. Um, so, yeah, guys, I think I started off, and I think I caught on to it real quick. Um, now, I did took the time and watched videos and, you know, um, subscribed, and that's what kind of gave me the courage to you know, do my own videos. Um, 
launch my own channel and try to do this and you know help people um, do some of these deals I might not be so into dev like other uh, youtubers or other channels um, but I've had a lot of um, a lot of uh, awesome people that that have helped me along the way um, a short story of how I started couponing is my daughter's um, my daughter's friend's mom she coupons and she's been doing this for years and so um, I one day asked her I said would you be able to teach me like how to do this so she took me into her kitchen unorganized as an as you know like they say um, your or you have an organized mess she had an organized mess. Only she knew where where something was. Only she knew where her ECBs were. Only she knew because if I would have picked up that bag, I had no idea what in the world I was picking up. All I saw was receipts and receipts and rolls and rolls of ECBs and cards and cards of Target. And I was like so amazed of... Um, of how she did it and so all she did was sit me down and show me a few receipts and I was able to ask as many questions as I could she took me along uh, with her um, a few times just so that I can kind of see and get that experience so that's when I started um, she advised me to um, start getting the newspaper um, and I saw their videos and I saw how people organized their coupons and I realized that this this was way better for me than the file cabinet way that a lot of people do um, but like I said it's my organized mess um, this is something that my son did for me I love you to the moon and I have no idea what this says but my son does little things for me from here and there uh, so yeah guys um, that's how I ended up starting um, I just it was just so so amazing how much stuff she had it was so um, intriguing of you know just how much she saved and so um, I just you know jumped and threw myself to the couponing world and faithfully every day I would watch videos and videos and videos and have ladies um, a lot of ladies that that I look up to um, so um, yeah guys and I still watch them till this day you know and I've I've um, I did my channel maybe about a few maybe about seven months I started my channel and um, it's been it's been pretty amazing it's been I didn't think I was gonna get to the the subscribers that I have now and it's been pretty pretty amazing so um, here pretty soon there'll be some great news and um, they'll be announcing um, but yeah guys this is it this is how I organize I do clip every coupon that I get eventually um, it takes time we all know couponing and 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 organizing our coupons so that we know where they're at it takes time and here's some more coupons right here so yeah guys I just wanted to come oh and this is my little thing that I also carry once in a while um, and in here I have it let's see if I'm, I'm sorry I'm only using one hand because I'm recording with the other one um, tabs to the stores that I most frequent and then in here are some coupons that I know that if I go to the store I can use these coupons towards this so most some of these might already expired and even in here like I try to clean it out as I'm putting new coupons but um, yeah this is what I still have so that I need to put up so I thought I was gonna do it this weekend it didn't happen like that but these are coupons that I know that I might find things at this particular store, so I hold on to them and put them in here, so that whenever I do a, a quick run to the store, I um, take my little uh, handy dandy little, I don't know what these things are called, 
um, and I um, take it in and try to see if I can find that product and stuff. So I have CVS and I might have here some, I don't know what these are, some CRTs, probably expired. Because this one was in my husband's card and I had it in there for a little while. And there's some school coupons or pencil pen coupons that I still need to use. Some rain checks for those particular stores. I also keep these uh, coupons that they print out and you can use at that store. So I have those in here. It just makes it easier for me to grab it and go if I have to. Or if I'm doing like my... Um, my shopping, uh, my couponing trip, I kind of just throw stuff in there. Uh, there's some more. Walmart. Um, Rite Aid, some of my receipts and stuff that I have in there. And then the bag is just miscellaneous. I have no idea. Probably already expired stuff. Um, I honestly, I haven't been able to take the time to kind of clean out and and get organized but this is what eventually it looks like um, I didn't want to take the time and organize it just because I wanted to show you what it was on an everyday you know every time that I pick up this folder and put it in my bag and go to um, CVS or Rite Aid or Walgreens or Dollar General Dollar Tree this is what I carry um, it's pretty heavy I carry it in a bag and um, but this is my way of organizing my my coupons. Um, it's just easier for me to kind of go already go in here. And you kind of eventually know where your stuff is. I'll know that if I know my shampoo is not going to be all the way over here. It's going to be mostly at the front. And I know where kind of my food and my household and makeup is going to be. So these little tabs that my daughter helped me do are pretty awesome. And it's something that's more personal. I love the personal stuff. Um, I enjoy having... Um, where my kids can help me and um, and do stuff you know for me um, so yeah guys this is it um, so this is it I mean this is how I do it and um, I know everybody has their own organized mess but this is my organized mess guys but um, thank you guys for uh, watching I can't express uh, just how much I I appreciate all you guys uh, subscribing within the uh, more than a year that I've I've uh, launched my channel and became a couponer. Um, I haven't become the perfect couponer. Uh, I've had awesome deals, great deals, uh, zero out of pocket deals, and then I've had deals like just yesterday where I paid nineteen dollars for toothpaste and and coat and mouthwash, and I was like why did I do that? Like, it, I just, I had to go. I just did a video that I just, I probably already posted, but um, I had to go redeem myself. I just had to because um, it wasn't, it wasn't nice. I wasn't feeling very well that I had just spent so much money. But yeah, guys, this is it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and maybe it inspires you to create your own folder or however you um can organize your coupons so that you can have your own organized mess but thank you guys for watching like subscribe comment and like i said i will be announcing something here pretty soon i just need to uh, reach that milestone so uh hang on in there and hopefully um hopefully yeah <laughs> i don't want to say too much but um thank you guys for watching like subscribe comment and um uh, thanks for watching bye bye